Hiya Foxes, today's guide is going to be a little different than my others. It's going to cover strength, attack, defense, and hit points. All of these are trained through melee fighting, so this guide will be broken up into levels. Ideally, you would only move into the next training area when both strength and attack are at the same level. It's also recommended to get your defense to the same level, but it's not always required. Bringing more food or a higher healing food will help negate low defense. Hit points will level passively along with any combat skill you're actively training. If you like my guides, hit the subscribe button and become a fox. Thanks! Questing. It's recommended to start off doing quests that give strength as it will allow you to hit harder and wear better equipment from the start. Majority of the quests are quick to complete and only have a few requirements. Some do have boss fights, and usually they can be safe spotted with magic or ranged, or you can use protection prayers if they are available to you. Completing all of them is a total of 65,275 attack, 27,537.5 strength, and 15,300 defense experience. This will get you to level 45 attack, level 37 strength, and level 31 defense without doing any melee training. It is also recommended to do Witch's House as it will greatly increase your hit points. There are also other quests that give attack, strength, and defense experience, but they have higher requirements. Levels 1 to 10. Kill chickens across the river in Lumbridge. They can't kill you, you don't need food, and there's plenty of them, and they give you pretty good XP. Levels 10 to 60 or 70. Ammonite crabs on Fossil Island. These guys are the best for training at medium and high combat levels. They have high health, low defense, and low attack, so you need little to no food. They also have a 10 minute aggression timer and usually clump in groups of 3 or 4, making it easy to pick a spot and have them automatically aggro to you. Turn on auto retaliate and you can AFK for 10 minutes at a time. Sand crabs and Hosidius are a good alternative. From level 60 to 70 and or 99, it's recommended to do Nightmare Zone found just north of Yanil. It's the fastest solo experience for attack and strength if using Darox. It's also a pretty good AFKable training method while gaining points you can spend on imbuing items later. Slayer is also a viable method. Most of the time, also very AFKable and grants you Slayer points while working on leveling your combat stats. And that's all I have for this one, guys. There are other methods, so check out the OSRS wiki if you're interested. Thanks for watching.